invited a couple of experts in canineology. First up is a world-renowned documentarist, has numerous specials on PBS, writes for National Geographic, and has hundreds and hundreds of pages of research. Let's welcome down here Dr. Brett Sieber. I like his family. I'm part of that family. Come on over, Doctor. Tell us a little about yourself. Oh, are you doing tonight, huh? I'm good. Excellent. Well, thank you very much for having me. I am so excited to be right here in West St. Paul, Minnesota to talk all about my biggest passion, dogs. All right. Well, thank you. Take a seat over here. Come on down. All right. Next up, we'd like to invite out 25-year-old grad student, still living at home with her parents. Her major is in social media, and she's waiting for a job that pays lots of money. Come on down, Monica Rockwater. Come on over, Monica. Tell us a little bit about yourself. We'd like to hear. Monica? 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 All right, well, all right, well, I guess we'll get right to it then. Let's find out. Dr. Brett, what does the fox say? Well, I'm glad you asked. I think it's, it's not a simple question because fox are a very, you know, very complicated beast. I mean, there are so many different sounds they make. I mean, depending on the situation they're in. If it's a stressful, I gotta run, there's danger, there's one noise. If it's, hey, I'm a boy and there's a girl and I gotta make a little different noise for that, then you got that. You might even have just the playful. I mean, there's so many different, I mean, maybe we have to be a little more specific with the question. Well, all right, Monica, would you like to re review that? What does the fox say? Um, and if you watch internet at all, you would probably know that there's a video about this. She's right. There's lots of videos on the internet about I mean, some of my absolute favorite are the ones where you see the fox in the wintertime, and it's sitting on the snow, and you're thinking, why is that fox just sitting on the snow? But then as you watch, it's listening with its ears. And so as it hears the mice, it doesn't mean to see the mice, it just hears the mice, and it kind of rears back, and then poof! Right into the snow it goes, and it grabs the mouse like that. I mean, I've, I mean, if that's that the one you're talking about? No, no, no. She's talking about the video on the internet, the one with all the animal sounds. You know, dog goes whoop, cat goes meow, bird goes tweet, mouse goes squeak. You know that. Monica? The cow says moo, the, the elephant says toot. The fish goes blub. Everybody knows that. Whoa, 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 whoa. The fish, the fish goes blub. Blub. Yeah. Blub. And the, the elephant, the elephant says, "Toot." Yep. This is this you is this it. this is the amazing yeah. research video that we're talking. These, these animals aren't even related to fox. What does this have anything to do with what a fox? I mean, this it's cutting edge research. It's all over the internet, Doctor Brett. You know, it even has its own Wikipedia site. Why would the internet lie? I work in television news. Why would I deceive you? Well, I'm going to be quite honest. I'm feeling quite deceived at this very moment. I mean, just because it's on the internet, oh, that makes it so? Oh, yes, of course. Yeah. Everything the computer and the TV tells me is absolutely true. Well, I got my master's in social media, so I would know about this. That's right. Well, Dr. Brett, why don't you tell us what you think the fox says? You know what? Good, because this conversation needs some real live facts, because so far I'm sorely disappointed. Hold on. Let's see it. So, uh, you, got, you can't just go into this all willy-nilly. you got to stretch a little. And then, like the key, so what I'm going to give you, I'm going to give you the distress call, the danger call. That's, that's the big one. And so it comes from down deep. And so you kind of got to get low, gotta get down low, low. And you kind of got to feel it rise up, and you got to... Oh my, that was interesting, but that's not what I've heard. Monica? Pam, let me help you out. It goes like this. Ring, ding, 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 ding. That's what the box says. That's more like it. No, no, someone's phone was ringing. Did you or, someone, someone answer your phone or just turn it off? Please. Okay, what if you don't that? recognize that, call me up. There it is. The other one goes like this. Hotty, 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 ho. Like that. 
No, yeah. no, 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 no. Yeah, that's what it says. No, it's not. Have you have you actually spent time in the field with the fox? Like, like I have lived with the fox. Like I have. It's cold. Why would I do that? But I'm just telling you what you just the ring a ding, ding, da ding, da ding. No, I'm sorry, that's not it. You know what? Um, well, I have a solution. How about we find out what the fox says once and for all? I have a way to solve this. Here we go. I can't wait to see what the internet has provided you with this time. The internet never lies. Mm, yeah. Well, this is Pam Willespich signing out here at WDNC. I guess we'll never really know exactly what the fox says tonight or any other night after that. Does it work? And the sea goes out.